We have the middleweight world champion, Kelly Tavik, with UnifiedChamp.com. How are you doing, Kelly? Doing good, but Kelly, you demolished him. It was a demolition. You got the rust off. You're trying for a mega fight. You must be pretty happy after the last couple months, brother. I am. It's good to get back in there, you know, shake that rust off. Uh, we didn't think that we would have any. Uh, cardio was good, but it was just the fact the arm started getting a little tired, you know, in the third, fourth round. But, you know, we started getting our second win there, too, and, and uh, we came through. I'm not sure if the uppercut was part of your uh, your initial game plan, Kelly, but it seemed when you discovered it in the second or third round, it was the end of the fight. That's when the fight was over, in my opinion. So it was there, you know, and we were doing little angles. We to the body, we took that little step, you know, he didn't know it was coming. We fired that uppercut, and I think that's what it was like. Oh, Kelly, Paul Williams is next, right? And uh, he's been talking a lot. But if Sergio Martinez can knock him down and hurt him with his offhand, what is Kelly Pavlik's strong hand going to do to him? He won't get up. That's the difference. <laughs> Unified champ, thank you, Kelly Pavlik. Thank you, bud. Can I take a picture of Kelly Pavlik? Unified champ, we have Miguel Espino. He put up a great fight. Looks strong. He can hurt Kelly at times. How you feeling, pal? Uh, a little sore. Um, nothing too crazy. Uh, probably won't sleep tonight because I have a early flight. So, but that's okay, man. I'm I'm happy. Okay, and um, do you you gave a good account of yourself, and someone mentioned this is a stepping stone. I was an athlete, and and I completely agree with that. Um, sometimes in defeat, you can realize how great you can become one day. And, and do you feel that way? Uh, I don't know about the great part. I mean, it'll take a lot of hard work to be great. Um, I don't want to categorize myself as that yet, but I definitely could be special, and I definitely. I do see myself as, as a middleweight champion. Okay. And when do you want to get back in the ring? Um, like, what, what's, what's the turnaround here? In your mind, if you had your choice, obviously, you have promoters, but where, where would you want to go? I would think um, take a couple of weeks off, you know, enjoy Christmas and New Year, but um, probably late January, February. That would be a good time. Unifiedchamp.com, we thank you. We will be watching you. We'll be following your career, and we'll be in touch, my friend. Thank you very much for having me.